Well, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and on an experimental basis, I'm opening up roleplay uh, on Mars Station while I'm contemplating different plots for next episode. And I want to explain how this works. This is at the TP point or near it on Mars Station. Actually, this is Alien Artifacts. Mars Station is up above. Now, this sign contains all the avatars, all the normal avatars, human avatars that I use. If you're going to use these, uh, try to be in character and watch uh, my uh, videos to learn more about the characters. These have to be worn exactly as is. Can't use custom skins or anything different. That's to preserve the integrity of uh, things. Now there's no no card in here. There are avatars, there are weapons, there's a shuttle. A space shuttle will fit in the uh, hangar bay up on the station. So you have a lot to choose from here. They have to be used, used exactly. You can't substitute anything. You cannot modify shape or anything. It's, I need to maintain the integrity of the series. Now this series may be recorded for my use, but you will be given credit if you get recorded and put into a series, you will be given credit. Now, that's phase one. Now, up here... I'm sorry this is going to take so long, but, uh... I just have a lot to go over. Here are the avatars. You, uh, click on the leftmost, um... box, and you buy it. It's free. You don't pay anything. And then you put, click on each other box, left click on them. I'll show you. Now, there aren't a lot of choices for males, unfortunately. On Second Life, that's just the way it is. And I just clicked on all of them, and it says accept. Accept, 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 or discard. Now, you make individual choices there if you want, as far as what you accept or don't accept. So how am I going to know? I'm not. But you have to use while it's flying. And the whole reason is to maintain the integrity of the series. Okay, so we're going to drag the stuff into the That's how you do it. You know, it just fold one of the you know, second lights, uh, usual stunts. Now, if I got everything in there, I just took down a couple of sets, so there's other stuff in my recent category. We'll see if I've done this right. I don't have a lot of hair there, it just isn't that much out there for males. This is why I usually get. Yeah, That's why I use mostly female avatars. There's a lot more for females than there is for males. Alright. So there's your basic male avatar. All these have to be used exactly as they are. Are you doing male or female? I'm a little more flexible. 
I think I left, you can tweak the, uh, shapes a little bit. Uh, in fact, I would encourage, I may have to augment the breasts of a uh, female because they use those, uh, shapes for other things, so you might have to make them a little taller, that type of thing. That, minor modification like that is okay, I don't mind that. But all the clothes have to be used exactly as they are. So now we're going to go out and show you the station. fits in. There's a whole bunch of stuff in that uh, sign. And there's no card in there to explain to you in more detail than I can do here how this works. See how this is empty now? So, I'm going to go back out. And we're going to click on the sign. It says touch the rest of the demo. If you see that, then it rests. And bingo! Everything is starting to rest. Takes a few seconds. So there you have it. Uh, you click one sign before you go into space, and then. It rises and it takes on the other set down. This is conserved prims, so you can only use one space at a time. That's all I do is use one space at a time, and I res them as needed. The, the whole idea behind building a station, I want something that looked a little more impressive, but uh, it was to conserve prims. Very, very critical. Now I got over a thousand, still not a lot to work with, but. There's limits to what I can do. So, that's basically what you do. And you can bring the sh space shuttle in through here if you want an RP flying it in here. This is not a solid barrier, it's in Phantom. And you can see we're a long way from the ground. Now, a lot of these TP pads, the green ones will work for you, the pink ones won't. Those are for me and my alts. And one more thing, I'm going to show you the... Uh, place where you can build the sites. There's three levels where you can build the sites. Cleans every three hours, just like the sandboxes do. They opened up levels one, two, and three. I'll try to uh, have like grassy texture. This is for building sets like you're on a planet. Now this is not a violence free zone. This is a space combat type of situation to an extent. There are some weapons supplied. You have to supply your own meter. I recommend the Wild West meter. It works really well. But that's up to you. You know, use your favorite meter. If you don't want to use Wild West meter, that's fine. Uh, build your sets. There's a three hour time limit, like you said before. You just stuff starts getting returned to your inventory. That's about it. Uh, have fun. Role play. You may be recorded. You'll be given credit if you are recorded. If I like the role play. I'm up there. I will record you and include you in a movie. I may even expand this and uh, give people a plot ahead of time. We'll see about that. 
Haven't worked that out yet, but, uh... Roll, go ahead and role play. Have fun. Wear the uniforms and the avatars exactly as they are. With no modifications. Other than the modifications, you know, tweaking, you might have to tweak the, uh, what do you call it? You might have to tweak the shapes a little bit, especially for the females, to so make them a little taller, augment them a little bit. That's fine. I don't mind that. But not from the, you can't do that with the station personnel. Those are fixed. Smart effects Mars, I've went way longer than I wanted to, but there's a lot to go over, so make sure you click on the sign, get that note card, it'll tell you more. You know, just basically buy it, it's free. You buy the contents and it's free and you can find more information on the note card. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Artifacts of Mars.